Welcome to Tech Guy channel. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to enable USB debugging mode on Android phones. USB debugging can be activated after connecting your phone directly to a computer using a USB cable. With this mode, you can create connection between an Android phone and another computer with Android SDK or software development kit. As the name suggests, this is a software which can help you develop new Android apps. With help of USB debugging mode, you can establish a direct connection between your Android phone and a computer to make it available for deeper level actions. For some versions of Android, the USB debugging mode is termed as developer mode as well. Let's start enabling USB debugging mode. Before you can enable USB debugging mode, you have to turn on first developer options. To enable developer options, open the settings screen, scroll down to the bottom, and tap about phone or about tablet. Hit the software information, then look for the build number. Tap the build number field 7 times to enable developer options. Tap a few times and you'll see a toast notification with a countdown that reads you are now x steps away from being a developer. When you're done, you'll see the message developer mode has been enabled. Tap the back button and you'll see the developer options menu just below the about phone section in settings. This menu is now enabled on your device. You won't have to repeat this process again unless you perform a factory reset. Now, you can enable debugging mode. To do these, you'll need to jump into the developer options menu, scroll down to the debugging section, and toggle the USB debugging slider. Once upon a time, USB debugging was thought to be a security risk if left on all the time. Google has done a few things that make that less of an issue now, because debugging requests have to be granted on the phone when you plug the device into an unfamiliar PC, it will prompt you to allow USB debugging. If you still want to disable USB debugging and other developer options when you don't need them, slide the switch at the top of the screen. Developer options are power settings for developers, but that doesn't mean non-developer users can't benefit from them as well. USB debugging is required for things like ADB, which in turn is used for rooting devices. Once your device is rooted, the possibilities are endless. This covers how to enable USB debugging mode on Android phones. If you found this tutorial is helpful, please give us a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe on our YouTube channel for more great tutorials. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.